always think of Alexander Wang as being a happy hip hop kid. So it was quite a change in direction to see him go all Marilyn Manson tonight. But there was a real dynamism in that heavy metal stomp. His clothes are always about a very urban girl, and that was about a very dystopian urban girl. Yeah, it was a little foot stomping. Some of the use of materials was a little Balenciaga-esque, and you, you know, you can see the correspondence between what's happening in that brand and his own brand. You know, I do feel like he's maturing as a designer, and you can see it, you know, on his runway. I always think of you as being a bit of a hip-hop kid, and to go so sort of goth metal, what's going on? We've kind of been on a very sporty journey, you know, the last collection about sneakers and then the H&M collection, and I felt like I just wanted to do something polarizing, you know, something that would kind of play with this idea of a harder edge sensibility. And so I started thinking about a new romanticism that initially led us to, you know, Victorian dressing and corsetry, and then I started thinking about heavy metal hair bands and, you know, uh, Marilyn Manson, and implementing in a way that becomes archetypes of what we felt are street wardrobe staples, you know, a pea coat, a car coat, a tailor jacket. He was thinking about what his customers are always asking of him, and they always want black clothes. And so the challenge for him, I think, was how do you make black great for the runway? And I think he did that via punk hair, the shoes, the metal studs. There was just this kind of connection, and, and I thought, well, let's also explore it through utility, because that's something that I always love. So, you know, all the snaps that came from bulletproof vests, and um, the different padded liner coats, and of course, the chainmail dresses that we put all the boots, velvet, corsets on. I thought the women were Amazons of the night. I want to be part of this cool gang of the girls that are you know, naughty and wild and strong. I always like my girls kind of feeling quite strong, quite protected, you know, they're, they're urban warriors. 